Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I am heading to Manchester with my modelling agency to shoot a campaign. So yeah, I thought I'd just take you all along with me and just show you everything we get up to. So first things first, I went to get my nails done and look how unreal they look. This is literally the perfect nude now. As an absolute nightmare because I forgot that it was Sunday and there were literally no nail shops open. But yeah, I got my nails done and then headed off to Manchester. Went to Itsu also because I was starving and really craving sushi. So the journey from Brighton was literally hectic and I didn't arrive in Manchester until 11pm, which was not ideal. So just made it to the hotel a little bathroom check bathroom is actually really cute i've already been in like set up all of my stuff i'm in a hotel i actually have to make myself at home we'll definitely be having a bath in the morning this is the room like pretty standard not a window so you know probably will not be able to breathe i've already got my pajamas and brought my slippers literally so prepared and um, put my laptop and my phone on charge but yeah we made it to Manny. So I'm actually excited. Um, the journey was horrific. The wheel of my suitcase broke. So I've been traveling with three wheels. The whole journey here, my charger has been being scraped on the floor. So my charger is literally like, I'm gonna put a picture here. Slippers are on. I forgot to bring face wash with me and I don't wanna use like hand wash on my face. I'm just gonna use some of the ordinary toner. I literally use this every day and it's now finished. It's currently 12.07. I have to be at the shoot at 8.30. So I really should be asleep by now. But I like not long ago got to the hotel. So in my jammies. See you in the morning with the girls ready for the shoot. Just in the Uber on the way to the shoot and literally went straight into hair and makeup when I got there. Because my hair is curly and today I'm going for a really straight, sleek look for this shoot, they got started on my hair first because he needed to blow dry my entire head of hair and straighten it. This is my little makeup station and how cute is it? And they made these little mood boards and I'm literally obsessed. I've never had a client do this. It just shows how much time and effort's been put into the shoot, so I really love that. There's Liana's one and then there's Daisy's one. After seeing these mood boards, we were literally so excited to actually get everything done and see the final result. This is just the camera crew setting up everything for the day and then we all just had some breakfast, which was really nice. There's just Liana getting her glam done and look how much she is laying right now. If you've been around here for a while, you know that my hair is so curly so the fact that he got it this straight i'm literally shook and it's rare for people to actually be able to do my hair properly so i was literally so happy i literally wouldn't stop touching my hair and shaking it around because i was so obsessed daisy started getting her makeup done next and literally look how flawless she is so the girls started having their extensions applied and we were literally so excited because when we got there they said you can keep the extensions or we can take them out for you so obviously all of us want to keep the extensions but yeah now it's time for my glam and i literally was obsessed like i was sat there taking notes because i need to know how to do my makeup like this also, when you're getting your makeup done at a shoot, it literally feels like your safe space. And not to mention, this is Miss Molly Mae herself's makeup artist. So I felt honoured to have her doing my makeup. And this is how it turned out. I literally loved it and I didn't want to take it off at the end of the night. Because, wow. This is the outfit. A little Skims vibe. My makeup literally looks so good. And hair is so shiny. It's so straight. And this is the outfit on. Trousers are a bit big, but they're going to clip them. I'm just gonna take a moment for the glam because wow like she really did her thing also with shoots like there's so much waiting around because everything's happening all at once and especially when it's three different people on a shoot so I had so much time to kill and I was just taking so many pictures of myself and going around getting the BTS for the girls because someone has got to get the BTS for everyone's YouTube channels and everyone's TikToks and Instagrams and whatever else <laughs> I still need to rest my hair. Well, not me personally, but um, the hairdresser is such a nice day. Maya is killing it. The little like head bits. You got little buns. A 
I won last time with Ray. Oh yeah, beautiful. Just I'm just gonna start thinking. Wow, Slay Queen. Wow. 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 <laughs> Gorgeous. This lighting's really good, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> we said bye, but hello at the same time. Hello. Shoot is done. It was honestly such a good shoot. You smashed it. And so did you. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're on the way to the station. Where are you going back to? Edinburgh, guys. Edinburgh. I'm going back to Brighton. It's going to be five and a half hours. So long. You look really nice. Oh, do Yeah. Bye bye, Manchester. Bye, Manchester. I <laughs> love you. Bye. So these were the final images that came out after the shoot and it literally came out like three days after. I can't believe how quick they got it done. Thank you so much for watching and here is the final video from the shoot.